and welcome to Redlandia. Some of you may recognize me from local short films Frogman vs. Batman Parts 1 and 2, or perhaps you've seen me hopping around the streets of Portland. But if you're like most people, you have no idea who I am. I'm Portland's one and only super anti-hero. I keep it weird, I feed the homeless when I can, I occasionally host uh, charitable pub crawls organized by Stumptown Pub Crawlers, and I also do a wee bit of activism in this fine city of politically aware individuals. But mostly I get drunk and bar hop and, uh, and do a little bit of dancing because I like to dance. I've talked to a lot of folks who have watched Portlandia or have heard the phrase put a bird on it too many times and feel the show represents more of the yuppie hipster or the yipster huppy pearl district scene rather than uh, the real people that are really keeping it weird. You know, there's tons of musicians, local businesses, and underground subcultures that contribute to making this city funky, fresh, and unique and truly what it is. And uh, today I'd like to introduce you to a handful of street performers that my righteous opinion uh, are truly one of the main reasons why when people think Portland, they think weird. So let's hop around and go meet some weirdos. It's raining. It's raining. You want to tell me about your rainy day? Eh, uh, crappy. Why is it a crappy day, Elvis? Why is it a crappy day? I don't make any day. money at all. And I'm not really liking being out here in the cold and wet either. Well, you should know that you're like, you bring a lot of joy to the city, man. And yeah. people love you. Even in a crummy, rainy, penniless day, like, you're bringing a lot of good and weird to the city.
not a lot of people know about is a, it's kind of like Fight Club, but it's a wrestling club. But it's mostly it's like people that had embarrassing moments in seventh, eighth grade wrestling. So there's this whole underground scene. I can't really talk about it much, but it's it's pretty embarrassing when we all get together and put on our singlets and kind of get down. It's true. There's wrestling clubs all over this town. You don't even know about late night cocaine fueled wrestling clubs that are just crazy with all of these really like famous people in Portland, the Portland Underground wearing singlets and wrestling one another. And the biggest thing is we're all trying to make weight, so that's why I'm eating this milkshake here because I got to get up to like 152. I've been wrestling at 148, so I got to get it up. I got to get up past 150. They give us a little bit of leeway. But... Red and white stripes for the strange sight people point and stare. Some people like me, some people don't. They don't. Some people fight me.
brown people are square, but we don't fit. <laughs> That's right. We don't fit. <laughs>